For some of the local hunters that live deep in the Bornean jungle, there can only be one explanation for the dead carcasses of muntjac deer which show up from time to time. According to the reports, these bodies are discovered relatively untouched besides for a critical wound to the throat and the elimination of some internal organs. Instead of pointing the finger to one of the larger carnivores on the island, they believe a small but ferocious rodent is to blame. Now, if you're wondering how one of these vampire squirrels might achieve such a challenging task, the story goes that they will creep on some of the lower hanging branches and wait for an unsuspecting animal to stumble below. Once in range, they then lunge down and strike at the animal's jugular. After it bleeds out, the squirrels are free to disembowel the lifeless body and selectively munch on its stomach contents, heart, and liver. Of course, these are some grand claims and must be taken with a giant cube of salt. But maybe this kind of traditional knowledge is rooted in some more humble truths like the carnivorous behaviors of other squirrel species that actively hunt small birds. Considering this squirrel has only been photographed a handful of times and is relatively unstudied, it may be best to keep an open mind during further investigations, or at least that's what Emily Majard and her colleagues recommend who shared this riveting story from the locals in their most recent paper which includes other more scientific discoveries regarding the tufted ground squirrel. As always, a link can be found below. Once again, thanks for tuning in, and giddy up.